Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of Tales of Vesperia. Alrighty, when we left off, we had, well, we had gone into the inn, slept a little bit, we came out to find out that there is some shenanigans going on in town, apparently led by, uh, Captain, or rather, Com I have no idea what to call him. Um, I don't know what his rank was. I don't really recall, nor do I care, because he is apparently a scumbag. So, now we're going to deal with the scumbag. Heading on right down to where apparently they are forcing labor out of most of the townspeople down here. Which is not okay in the slightest. Who are you? I used to work upstairs, but I was forced to come down here. Cooking for the laborers morning and night. There's no time to rest. Well, yeah, that makes sense. Kind of need to force someone to cook for them. So that way they actually, you know, don't die or something. Well, they might be a problem. You damn slacker, there's no time for rest. On Sir Cumor's orders, the construction must be finished in under a month. Yeesh. What are you doing? What the hell? You planning on disobeying too? You know, I've never been good at taking orders. Well. Get ready. I'm taking you down. All right. Only half of that actually hit. Okay. There we go. The sign of victory. Alright. Hey, that kinda hurt. What? What? That kind of hurt? Are you for real? Are you for real right now? Also, wow, that's a lot of gold. I'm okay with that, but wow, that's a lot of gold. All right. Yeah, I feel good. I bet. These are the threads that weave our future. Cool. Did you come to this town because you heard you could become nobility too? Yeah, I guess you heard the same thing. About that. Why don't we skip the small talk? Shouldn't you be heading back up there? Oh yes, that's right. I've got to tell my friends I'm okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You may have spared him from the truth now, but he's still going to find out sooner or later. What are you talking about? We just don't have the time for a long conversation right now. Hmm, whatever. Not like I care, anyway. Okay, Sundare. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna have to be doing a lot of that, I'm assuming. Not that I'm complaining. Okay. They have kids down here? What the hell? Oh, you were brought here from upstairs, too. At this hour, all the adult workers are at the construction site. Why are there... Why would they force kids down here? Well, hello. You know the punishment for running away? A hundred lashes and a night in the water. <gasps> that is beyond messed up. Please have mercy. You had the nerve to abandon your work, and yet you still beg for mercy? What insolence. Oh, I'm gonna have fun killing you. But I can't move my arms anymore. That's enough. Who the hell are you? It is absurd that anyone could re would resist the Cumor Brigade. I shall bring you to justice. The Cumor Brigade does not roll off the tongue. <laughs> I tell you what. Okay. 
glad to hear it. I won't lose. Neither will I. Let's go. Oh, ooh. this one's have spear. I like that. There we go. All right. Oh, you stop that. Ow. Okay. Well, light. I almost said light Nancer. That ain't right. Night Lancer. Okay, that's what I meant to say. There we go. Conceal wave. Whoops, oh, that's not the way I wanted to. Yes, take a nice long nap. Well, my grade is getting worse as time goes on, but still, I'm making a lot of gold off of beating these guys. So I'm going to keep doing that. <laughs> Even if I'm getting my butt handed to me, it's still worth it. Night, holy water, life bottle, and iron tip. Okay. You saved my life. Think nothing of it. What kind of work were you doing here, anyway? I was helping in the construction of a military base for the Dongrest invasion. Yep. Knew it. But wasn't this town supposed to be built for the nobility? Yeah, that's what they said. That's just a front. They're really trying to build a massive facility. Um, so you're saying that they're tricking people and forcing them to work against their will? Under the pretense that they're building a town for nobles. And they're doing all of that on Qmore's orders, right? Right. Well. Finally, the expedition... Exposition. Expedition. That ain't right. Oh, boy. Words. Words are hard. <laughs> The exposition has finally come out, telling us that it was all a lie. But that the real goal is to build an invasion platform against Dongrest. Makes sense, because he hates Dongrest, apparently. So this is what happens when idiots are allowed to run wild, apparently. Humor, you aren't going to get away with this. Well, here's hoping we can stop him. Why don't you head back home? R really? Or you could stay here if you want. It's none of my business. Don't worry. We'll do something about Kumor. Thank you so much. All right. Let's go find Kumor. Beat some sense into him. My grandson died on the job the other day. He always said working here would make him a noble someday. Oh my god. Great, these freakazoids are huh? back. Look who's here. And a group of those red eyes. Looks like Hugh Moore has become their new client. Seems like it. Hey, do you think that guy who talks all funny could be the Red Eyes boss? Talks all funny? <laughs> you mean speaks with a German accent? Come on, get a little perspective here. But yes, probably. It sure looks that way from here. Mm hmm. Or is at least the point of contact. Up. Oh. Get to work! No slacking off, you worms! You worms. Yeah, that's... Look, that's... It's Teagle! If it's money you want, you'll have more than you can use. Now work! Work! Wait! Uh, less than he deserves, but more than I would want. 
<laughs> Just a rock right across the forehead. <laughs> Love it. Yuri Lua, what are you doing here? You gotta thwart your plan, bish. <laughs> uh, princess. Yeah. You have no right to call yourself a knight. <laughs> you have done fucked yourself. Brute force is not the way to honor the prestige of the Empire. Put down your weapons now. You will also release the people you have tricked into coming down here. This all might be easier if such a naive little princess were to simply disappear. Is that a threat, Kumar? All of your utopian ramblings make me sick. And all of your bullshit makes me sick. Guess who's going to die because of your bullshit? That's not the you. kind of thing someone with delusions of becoming Commandant of the Knights would say. It's you. You'll be all right now. Jaeger, get rid of them. Yeah, my lord. Oh, boy. And of course his name is Jaeger. All right. Nothing personal, you see? Just business. Well, it's gonna be personal. So I've already dealt with these freaks before. Oh, ow! Ow, 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 ow. Okay, okay, alright. Oh, boy. They hurt a lot. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh. Oh boy. All right. Okay. Ha. 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 Whoo. Okay. All right. Okay. Oh, you little bugger. There we go. Just doing that until we all beat down. Ha ha! Bitch. Gotcha. Now, it's so much easier fighting these guys when I have a group of them. <laughs> oh boy! Oh. Oh no. Uh. Well, you're gonna be doing that anyway, so go, go ahead. Okay. Ow. Oops, and I'm dead. Well, that's bad. Okay, well, this is going badly. Uh do a life bottle. That's more important right now. Okay. Alright. Okay. Nope. It is not going to be your turn. You are. Okay. All right. I am in trouble. Oh boy. Okay. Um. Oh, if only I had a wide-ranging heal. That'd be great. I only have a heal for TP, not uh, you know, the thing that matters. Oh boy. All right. Okay. Damn it. Well. Okay. Okay. Uh, you're gonna have to he use a life bottle on me. I know. Don't worry. No, it's not. Oops. Well, had a feeling that should happen. Uh, but I was hoping it wouldn't. Grant us your favor. All right. We're not done yet. <laughs> okay. My favorite sleep. Are you okay? Alright. Okay. Damn it. This is very dangerous. Alright. At this point, I gotta deal with this guy. Beautiful. Whew. 
All right. Now that he's gone, focus on this dude. How could the Empire cover for such evil? We can't just let it go. We gotta catch him. Absolutely. Oh, the grade could have been far worse. <laughs> could have been far, far worse. But I'm happy it's at least plus eight. Huh. All right. Wow. How is it that I got more galled from beating the knights than I did this boss? Really? Interesting. Oh, well. More red lenses, magic lenses, and mystic cloth. Okay. I must admit, you're very strong. <laughs> Thank you for the uh, ego boost, but boy, was that a tough fight. Sir Kumor, it's the Flynn Brigade. Hey, the Flynn Brigade is coming in to help. Booyah. Flynn. Well, send him away. We tried, but he insists on coming down to perform an inspection. <laughs> that lower quarter lout, he simply has no tact. The pot calls a kettle black. Gosh, Dwight. Yes, Jaeger. Huh? Oh! This is our time to shine. That's where these two come in. Okay. Interesting. I think we better be making with the escape, yeah? Smoke bomb. Please step this way. Move, move. Time to get a move on. We'll get you next time. What an original line. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. If we don't follow them, they'll. Wait, our job is to rescue Teagle. But I don't know whose job is what, but are we following them or not? Everyone freeze! That's enough! Hey, just in time. Yeah. Yuri! Can you get up? Y yes Sorry, but it looks like something's come up. You'll have to head back by yourself. Say hi to the wife and kid for us. I will. And thank you. You're welcome. So we are going after them. Well, we can't let them just run away now. Yeah, I'm sure Flynn has things under control here. Sound good, Carol? Yeah. Plus, I think Estelle's gonna take off after him any minute. I mean, you're not wrong either. Sorry. No. It's Jeez, fine. we're going after them, right? So let's get going. All right. Yuri, oh, wait. Way to go. Oh, pff. come on, Flynn. Can this wait? Gotta run, Flynn. Lady Estelise, this journey is far too dangerous for... You know she's not going to listen. You know she's not going to listen, bruh. Carol's bag, part two? I wonder why my bag works so well when I hit enemies with it. Huh? You don't know how your own bag works? Yeah, not really. Surely the bag just has a high level of air conductance. Air conductance? It's a measure of how easily something carries air. The air produced when you use strike arts must be easily conducted through that bag. Hmm. So that's why enemies get weaker when I hit them with my bag? Exactly. It's the same as with my belt. Different people have different items that carry air for them more easily. Wow, interesting. Thanks, Rita. You sure don't know much about your own possessions. I guess I better take good care of my bag. Yeah, apparently. That you should. All right, so I'm lost as to where I'm supposed to be going. I guess we go this way. Wow, all of the enemies have just clustered right there. This looks easy. Don't let him trip you up. Ow. Holy Take this. Right right. this is kind of easy. Thank you so much. Hey, Repeat. Your tail? <laughs> what was that? What was that? Alright. These are the threads that weave our okay. future. Alright. Cool. Alright, now that that's done. 
Uh, let's actually look at the equipment. Oh, so he's finally got the strength up the, from the Surugi. Okay, good. Uh, where do we go next then? Uh, I think it was Blue Dragon, but I want to double check first. To be fair, the S-Dock plus one has stat boost. Not sure what that does. Increases the effect of magical status boosts. Okay. That would be kind of nice to have. And... Still need to learn BA Force and Spirits off of this. Anti-Element off of that. And Guard Arts off of... Guard Arts and Guard Plus off of Kalinga. Interesting. Okay, um... Let's go with the S-Stock for now. It's a moderate boost to almost everything. Uh, okay, there we go. The Epe plus one. She's already gotten everything off of the Wizard Horn, right? Yes, yeah, she did. Cool. Um, let's teach her everything with the Epe. She's almost got everything with the uh, War Pike, and then we'll move on to the Halberd, and then the... Actually, we'll move on to the Ore first, and then the Halberd, because the Halberd is far more useful. Okay. Uh, Bastard Sword, he's almost done with that. Almost done with the Kurama. Almost done with the high-powered Yo-Yo. <laughs> Didn't think I'd get to say that. Alright. Um, okay. I think that covers everything. Alright, good. Um, orange gel. Let's top off them. And myself. Especially top off Estelle. Alright, that should do it. So far so good. And actually, you know what? I'll just cook too. Why not? Cook a sandwich. Hey, hey! Not bad. Alright. Oh. You'll be gone soon enough. Very soon. Nice. We're done. Yes, we are. Alright, learned speed up. Good. That man called Jaeger certainly had a unique way of talking. Unique isn't the word I'd use. I had a hard time understanding some of the stuff he said. An ancient way of speaking lost in this day and age. What? Are you serious? It would at least make a good story if that were true. <laughs> <laughs> it would make a good story if that was true. You're right. That said, um... <laughs> where am I going? I now realize I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Which, you know, it's not a good idea. Especially when I'm running around. No, 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 no. Ow, oh, crap. Alright, there's no way down from here, so I'll have to go around anyway. Okay. <laughs> Where was I supposed to be going anyway? Ow. Man, How was I supposed to see them? Don't get cocky. Oh, I'm going to be cocky as much as I want. Ow. I got no time to think. Just beat them senseless and you'll win. I mean, you're not wrong. I feel this power inside me. Bug busters. Is that with his thing? Flynn was asking Weapon? for Estelle to come back with him, right? The knights can't help thinking that the best place for a princess is a castle. He's just worried that he won't be able to keep track of her. But Estelle decided to set out on this journey on her own, and you want to respect that. 
I haven't really thought about it all that much. The knights are bound to keep following you, though, as long as Estelle's with you. And what kind of a guild would we be if we didn't get into trouble with the knights? I don't think fighting with the knights is actually a guild requirement. <laughs> ah, well, I mean, we're treating it like one, so... Tough breaks. Okay, where were we supposed to go, then, if not this way? I don't you know. Wait, what? Um. <laughs> I really have no idea. So I'm not able to go back through the way I came. Then I have very little options left. We're done. All right. I feel this power inside me. Good for you. Oh, those two scheming together. What? You mean Kumor and Jaeger? Yes. Maybe they saw that they had a lot in common with each other. A lot in common? Like being raving lunatics. Whatever the case, they made one hell of a combo. I mean, looking at those two made me feel totally normal. Get a couple <laughs> of nasty people together and they'll put together some nasty plans. We were right to let Flynn deal with it before things got really out of hand. Very true. Very true. All right, we're going to have to top off on the TP again because they are running low again nope 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 the biggest problem I have is that I don't know where I'm supposed to be going with well this because if this is where Ah, uh, that explains it. There was a bridge right there You'll that be I couldn't see. Was that a little too painful? I don't know about that. Okay. So with that, we head over here. There's no sign of them. Hmm. Looks like they ended up getting away. Damn. Where are we anyway? A forest in central Tobikia. If I'm right, Torum Harbor is east of here. Yep. We should probably just get to the harbor rather than going back to Heliord. What? But what about Q Moore? Do we just let him go? I thought the purpose of your journey was to find Pharaoh. Technically, well, that's I... the main purpose. I wasn't aware Brave Vesperia was formed to follow your random whims. I I'm sorry. That was never my intention. Oh, she's just telling you to relax. Besides, Flynn's on the scene, right? You can be sure he'll take care of things. Hey, Pharaoh? Brave Vesperia, start explaining. Oh, that's right. She wasn't here for all of that. Just about to ask the same questions myself. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Hello, you old lecher. Huh? What the? <laughs> What's wrong, Miss Genius Mage? Forget me already. It's me, Raven the Great. Who gave you that nickname? Because I need to beat them. Who the hell do you... I told you, Raven the Great. <laughs> Man, you're a scary little kid, you know that? She, she's good at it. So, what are you up to? With all the stuff you've been doing, poor Raven got sent all the way out here to keep an eye on you. Mm -hmm. Why are you talking in the third person now? Why would they do that? First things first, let's go find an inn at Torum Harbor. I'll tell you everything there. Okay. Raven's pretty hungry, you see. Why do you alternate between first and third person? I suppose there's no point in hanging around here. True. Torum Harbor is a good first step. Exactly. Torum Harbor, then. Would that be all right? Yes, of course. Okay. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be selfish. Okay, let's That's go. That's understandable. Getting so close to 
bringing someone to justice and then just have them slip through your fingers, of course it would drive you insane. It drives anyone insane. It's not your fault. Yay, he joined the party, and then we can explain to Rita the stuff. That settles it. Our guild is off and running. What settles what? Our guild's gonna be called Brave Vesperia. Estelle came up with it for us. Hmm. Brave Vesperia, huh? Don't tell me you actually got Estelle to become a member. No. no, no. It's just the three of us for now. I'm the boss, and then there's Yuri and Judith, too. What do you think? Pretty awesome, huh? Yeah, it's amazing. They actually let you be the boss. <laughs> that was what I thought she was going to say. <laughs> Piece of cake! Don't get careless. Oh, boy. No. Ow. Turn the Take this! All right, who's next? Oh, so that shy. could be worse. Try and swarm! Well... Here I, go. I like the fact that all all these enemies are doing is just one bit of damage, really. I need to get stronger. I hope you can. You keep thinking like that, and I'm sure you will. Hell yeah! Especially carrying that big ass sword around. I'll get you strong one way or another. Trust me. All right. Oh, that's a nice little beach. I wish we could just hang out at the beach. That would be nice. Okay, Torum Harbor. Here we go. Wait, that's Kapua. Kapua Torum. That's right. Close enough. I know we haven't been I didn't read long, the whole <laughs> But I have to say, it still feels good to be back. I bet. Can I get you pansy some tissues? Or can we go to the inn now? I'm so hungry. Shut up, Raven. All right, all right. We'll go to the inn. Now just calm down. Who the hell are you? Nordopolica in Dessier is governed by a guild called Palestr Palestrale. That's a name. Their main business is operating the Colosseum there. Okay. Pollux. Actually, you know what? Pretty sure this is shopkeep. It is good. Come to the only store in Torum. Well, good enough for me. I need to restock all my stiff. Alright. Boy, did I get a lot of money to do that. Alright. That should be enough, I think. Uh, heavy mall scarf. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's fine. Cool. Alright, uh... Synthesis. Let's see what we can do. Uh, spike collar's already done. Okay. Let's see. I haven't done the blue dragon yet, so we'll wait on that. He's already equipped with that. And he's actually learned everything from it. Okay, so... Occasionally increases max HP after battle and taunt. And then this one is occasionally increases max TP after battle. Hmm. Health or... Hmm. Well, why, sh why should I decide? I can go for both. There we go. Now he's equipped with that. And he'll learn both. Alright. Eventually. We'll get there. Okay. Hmm. Why would I do that? That's silly. Carolinian Hammer... Sure, why not? It's not like it's going to be useful for anything else anyway. Hmm. Well, I can't do that one, but I could do that. Sm 
smash bow. Oh, okay. So that's another... It's another thing we can do for his weapons once we get the smash bow, whatever the hell that is. All right. And this way we can do both. It spends a lot of money. It spends way too much more money than I was intending. But it works, so hey. I'll take it. Battle suit. Oh! I didn't realize I still haven't had Carol equipped in that yet. Ooh. Not my intention, tell you what. Okay, holy cloak. She's already wearing that. Okay, cool. All right. I'm, I'm just doing a whole bunch of inventory management at this point. I apologize if that gets annoying, but it's kind of necessary at this particular juncture. Okay, I probably shouldn't sell some of the things that I desperately need. Or at least not as much of them as I was going to sell. Okay, uh, we'll leave about eight. That sounds good to me. Whoops, that's what I'm not what I meant. Here we go. Um, okay, yep. 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 Okay. So far, so good. Soul grass. What the hell is that supposed to be? No idea. Alright. Man, a lot of stuff out of that. Yeah, might want to hold on to more of those than I think. Okay. And maybe more of those than I think. Okay, soft tail. Yeah, that should be good. Sell all of that. There we go. Cool. Please come again. I will soon. Trust me. Okay, Pollux T. Let's actually talk at the inn, finally. Alright. But first, get a quick save in. Be right back. Alrighty, and with that done, we go... Enter this room, maybe? We're allowed to. Oh, Schmancy. And what about this one? Equally Schmancy. Who are you? You cuties look strong. Just my type. Oh, wow. It's 300 gold to stay. Do we have to? Do you have to spend the money? Could we not? Could we not do that? Uh, I'm not sure if I have a choice. The what? Huh? How strange. What's the matter? The Shagathim flowers are only supposed to open during the rainy season, and yet, look, they're already in full bloom. That sounds pretty weird. I know, right? I wonder if someone's been coming here and watering the ground or something. Would just that be enough to make these flowers bloom? And Judith is off doing something weird. Another cause for flowers blooming early could be in an imbalance in the air. So you're saying that this place... It's okay. Even if my guess is right, this level of air imbalance can occasionally be found in nature. Plants are simply more sensitive to changes in the surrounding air than humans, and they're reacting to that. We wouldn't want to have what happened in Heliord happening here. Yet, what the? Judy? The warehouse's aeroblastia is. Aeroblastia. 
I can't believe that Dragon Freak would do this again. I'm going to go see. Oh, Rita. Dragon Freak, huh? What's all this commotion about? Huh? It wasn't you? I plead the fifth. Okay. Localization team. I understand that there was not many options to use the phrase <laughs> that was actually said. But pleading the fifth really only works in a U.S. context because of the Fifth Amendment in the U.S. Constitution that isn't universal. <laughs> I'm sure you're aware of that, but still. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Okay, all right. All right. Okay. It was terrible. There was nothing left for me to fix. I'm sorry for your loss. Next time I see that freak, I'm going to punch him into the stratosphere. Stupid dragon freak. Constantly calling them freak, huh? Whoa, scary. I don't know what you're trying to do, but it's not causing any of you trouble, is it? I already told you. I'm not going to do anything that would cause any of you harm. I mean, true. It didn't cause us harm, per se. But it is hurting Rita a little. <laughs> At least emotionally. Oh, well, hi there. This town is so nice to live in. People are kind, the weather is not too hot, not too cold, and best of all, the president isn't here. <laughs> okay. I'm not going to ask what you meant by that. Okay. I wonder where I'm supposed to go then. Can I actually enter in there? Sign on the other side of the glass. Shop open on first floor. Come check out our goods. Okay. That's basically saying go downstairs, you idiot. Alright, well, with no other idea of what I'm supposed to be doing, I guess I'm going to sit here for now and then find out if I actually have to use the inn. I really hope I don't. I hate having to constantly spend money, but that is what it is. <sighs> anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so you can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games and Finally beating Qmor at his own game and then his lackey Jaeger with the red eyes shenanigans people. Uh, we beat them um, and then they ran away. So we'll have to find them eventually, probably. But th more likely than not, the story will just lead us to them as we continue our original search for Pharaoh so that way Estelle can talk to Pharaoh and figure out what's going on because sure as hell I don't know what the fuck's going on anymore. <laughs> this story has now gone far above my head and I wonder what will happen next for you.